And what up, y'all? It's your boy Chance. Now, if you guys don't know, I was sitting down after my last live stream playing Saints Row 3 and chilling and relaxing and whatnot. You know, I'm kicking in with some of my homies because if you guys don't know, on the Xbox One, on the Xbox One, they made it available to do, you know, online gameplay. So I'm sitting on there, kicking it, chilling, you know, doing my thing with my friends and stuff, and just hanging out and relaxing. When I hear my freaking notifications going off on my Facebook, and what do I see on my Facebook? Nothing but attacks towards me on my last live stream about why I did what I did and this and that. And honestly, I'm tired of the attacks. As I said, I'm not trying to justify what I said. I'm not trying to justify me saying the N-word. I'm not doing that at all. What I was getting at is that sometimes when you get pushed so far and you get bullied so much and pushed to a certain point, Sometimes you do shit that, you know, you understandably regret doing. And with Reborn Records and them doing what they did, ultimately, you know, that led to me, you know, making that stupid mistake and doing what I did. Yes, I do regret saying what I did. But honestly, y'all, these attack towards me, like, they need to fucking stop. You know, like I said, I ain't trying to justify shit. I'm not trying to justify me saying the N-word. I'm not trying to justify it at all. What I'm saying is I got pissed off because of Reborn Records talking shit towards me and doing the shit that they were doing on social media. You know, they weren't posting on social media. Like, they weren't going around posting on Facebook. What they were doing is they were looking at my personal Facebook and then going in and emailing me about the shit that I post on Facebook. That's what they were doing. And honestly, they don't have a right doing that. That's invasion of privacy. You know, you don't see me or anybody on Bloodshot Records going around looking at people's personal Facebooks. Like, if they're new artists, we're not going to go on their Facebook unless they have a song up there that they want us to hear. Then, yeah, we'll go check it out. But we don't go snooping on their profiles to try to start shit. And that's exactly what Reborn Records tried to do to me. Granted, yeah, I got pissed off, said some shit that I shouldn't have said. But that's no reason for y'all motherfuckers to go and sit there and attack me like you guys did. Like, for real. Like, you know, just because, you know, I say the N-word one time out of being so pissed off and fucked with that I'd had enough of it. Like, just because I say it one fucking time, that doesn't mean y'all got to sit there and jump my ass about it. Yeah, I know what I did was wrong. I get that. But that's no reason for y'all to sit there and just continuously fucking hound me about it. Like, seriously, these attacks towards me need to stop. You know, I just got done with one fucking battle for two to three months, which finally come, finally got put to an end and finally stopped. And now all of a sudden I got to battle again? Like, are you serious? Like, you know, I just get done fighting one fucking battle that I've been fighting for two to three months. And all of a sudden, I got to fight another one. And like, no, this shit ain't happening. Y'all need to chill the fuck out and stop these damn attacks towards me. Like I said, you know, I'm not racist. And I did apologize several times, in fact, to everybody that I have offended. Yes, I do regret saying the N-word and doing what I did. No, I'm not trying to justify it. I'm not trying to justify a damn thing. I know what I did was wrong and I really shouldn't have done it and I could have handled it better. But you guys got to understand, I got a short fucking fuse when it comes to being messed with like that. 
when somebody messed with me, there's only so much I can take before I fucking snap and flip a lid and say shit that pisses people off. You know, just like anybody else, I've got a fucking, you know, I'm a hothead. I got a temper. You know, I can't help it. I was raised like that. I can't help the fact that I got a temper. Do I try to control it? Yes. But when you get pushed so far to the point to where you fucking snap and you say shit, you know, people are going to get pissed at you because you're finally snapping off the handle and, you know, standing up for yourself. And that's what I was doing with Reborn Records. Granted, I said some shit I shouldn't have said, and I understand that. But you guys got to understand, these guys sat there and bullied me and bullied me, trying to get me to change who I am, wanting me to do shit their way and not understanding my situation, and then sitting there saying my stuff's trash. Like, I got emails upon emails upon emails of them trying to justify shit that they do. Trying to call me saying that I'm not professional enough, that I'm not this, that I'm not that, that, you know, I can't do this or that. And it's like, dude, I do whatever the fuck I want. You know, when it comes to music, I do shit my way, nobody else's way. And you know, like I said, I would rather be without a label that pays like Reborn Records. I would rather be without them and rock it while there's on Bloodshot Records and the original label that I started out on, which was Kill a Clown Sounds with my brother Eric Scrubble. I would rather rock those two labels than a label that's hypocritical, such as Reborn Records. Because they sit there and they say one thing and then they do another. And that's not right. At all. As I said, you guys, I'm not trying to justify me saying the N-word at all. I do apologize for saying that. I do apologize for anybody that I did offend to say that. That I did, you know, offend saying what I said. And I do apologize if I offended anyone. Wholeheartedly, I, you know, I apologize for that if I offended anyone. But you got to understand, there comes a certain point where you get pissed off and you snap, you're going to say shit that you don't mean to say. And I honestly did not mean to say that shit towards them. As I said, I was not meaning when I said it, you know, I didn't mean to make it sound the way that I did. I really didn't. But it seems like ever since then, I've got nothing but shit for it, and it needs attacks towards me need to stop. I just got done fighting one battle with my fucking ex for three fucking months that finally got put to a fucking end. I don't need these attacks again. I don't need to be fighting another fucking battle. What I need to be doing is focusing on my music. What I need to be doing is focusing on my artwork, my gameplay channels, my brand new reaction channel. I need to be focusing on that. Not sitting here fucking doing this shit. Fighting with everybody. Trying to defend myself. So as I said guys. If y'all could please stop attacking me. I would seriously appreciate that shit. Because I just got done going through a hard enough time. These last couple months. Fighting a battle against my ex. And yesterday was even harder because yesterday was my now past brother's birthday. So that was hard as fuck. So, you know, yesterday was not a very good day for me at all. But seriously, guys, these attacks towards me, they need to stop. As I said, I do apologize for anyone that I did offend. And yeah, I do apologize for losing my cool and flipping out the way that I did. And yeah, I probably could have handled it better. But there's only so much that I can tell you before I finally fucking snap and say something. 
as I said, what I said was wrong, and I do understand that. But as I said, there comes a certain point where enough is enough. And, you know, granted, yeah, the way I said enough is enough could have been taken better. But all the same, I was just defending myself. And again, you know, I do apologize for anyone that I did offend or anyone that I did upset. I do wholeheartedly apologize for that. But you gotta understand, I wasn't meaning it to be derogatory or fucked up or mean. I really wasn't meaning it to be like that. And I know I came off like that and I do apologize. But with that being said, guys, I do need to hop off here and just chill. And, you know, if any of you guys play Forza Horizon 4 or anything, hit me up. We can kick it on there on Xbox One or whatever, you know, chill and whatnot. But as I said, guys, please stop these attacks towards me, man. I've already gone through enough these last couple months. I don't need any more. All right? But with that being said, I'm out of here, guys. Later.